Here we go. Ah, oh, the light is in my eyes. Hi. Hello. Hi everyone. Um, it's Marta. Marta Labkowska here. Uh, finally, uh, here we go. Very first uh, talking live um, vlog, a chit chat, an interview with myself. Uh, however we call it, um, I just wanted to say hi in person. Welcome uh, to uh, my YouTube channel, my little uh, place in this world where I can share with you my love for art uh, and today it will be something different. I will be talking to you about things that inspires me, some news from the scrappy crafty world, uh, things that I hope you will find interested. But maybe before, um, before we start, um, maybe for those who, who are here for the first time, who don't know me, I should say a few words about me. So, my name is Marta Lapkowska. I'm a Polish girl living in Ireland since over 10 years now. Um, it's funny history because I came here to learn English for three months and that was the plan, which as you see it didn't work out exactly as I planned because I'm over 10 years now uh, in Ireland uh, in West Cork in County Cork it's a beautiful or most beautiful part of Ireland uh, if you have never visited Ireland most definitely you should visit um, I'm 32 years old what else I can tell you my biggest fun always my number one fan, it would be Emily, my my special girl, my my, my daughter. Uh, she's eight, and she is for sure the best thing that ever happened to me. Um, something else. My crafty journey started probably three years ago, but seriously, I understood what the scrapbooking, mixed media, journaling and all this uh, crack is about probably two years ago and since then I, 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 I'm I just completely in, totally in and I'm in love with all the creative things uh, that are happening around me I just love it, love it I cannot live without creating, crafting, making being inspired, inspiring others, just that's that's me, that's me. Um, what I do in life, I would love to say I'm an artist, uh, but I'm not really. I'm making things. I'm I'm creator. I I just love doing, experimenting, trying out. I love all kinds of uh, art uh, way of expressing yourself from journal pages, scrapbooking pages, card making, alter alter art, assemblage art, tags, ATCs um, because of Rika she introduced me to ATCs uh, mixed media would be Fenavar of course biggest, uh, I'm her biggest fan probably what else? Um, actually outside of my crafty site uh, every weekend, sometimes during the week, depends uh, on the week, I do uh, kids parties, I do kids events, I face paint them and you may think it's only face painting but for me it's artistic face painting, I love I love bringing face painting into different different level and I love seeing kids um, amazingly happy when they look in the mirror and they just cannot believe what they see so yes I do face painting and few other things with the kids Bosch certainly um, advanced detailed uh, face painting would be something I do every weekend and I cherish that I love it and this is my my job uh, oh and I dress up as Snow White um, again something uh, that you may not know about me um, so yes I'm my alter ego is Snow White <laughs> speaking about scrappy news uh, this week we had two big announcements for the scrappy crafty world uh, happy and sad 
starting from the sad one, um, very famous and big uh, challenge blog, Scrap Around the World, is closing down. Uh, Helen, the owner, decided to make an announcement and unfortunately the wonderful place for scrapping people uh, has come to an end. But saying that, a few design team members from Scrap Around the World decided to get together and create a new place. And they did, they did an amazing job. They created a blog, a challenge blog called More Than Words. I will show you their logo because it looks fantastic. And Dee Garling with few other, uh, with Heather, Nicole, Pamela, Rachel and uh, Valia, they decided to to make it together to create some new place for all scrappy people. Look at their gorgeous logo. It's stunning. It's more than words. Uh, a world challenge with a twist. Uh, they will run two monthly challenges. There will be one main challenge uh, and it will have two parts. One will be word, word one will be creative uh, challenge so you'll be inspired by world word or you uh, and you will have to be uh, inspired by color technique or mood board or sketch so there will be two parts in main challenge and those two has to be used uh, at the end of the month there will be also a mini challenge uh, where small forms will be uh, allowed like cards and tags um, I have seen uh, sponsors already, they are on the website and let me tell you sponsors are amazing. I have seen some challenges already and they look fantastic. You will love it and I'm sure you, you, you should join the fun, you should get together, find them on Facebook, find them on Instagram, follow their own blogger. I will have all the links below in this video. Um, Again, a brand new uh, challenge blog, support it, follow it, have fun, uh, because I'm sure it will be a great place to be. Uh, another announcement, um, for those who are looking for a creative team, um, there is a brand called Color, Color Blast, an uh, Australian brand looking for designers. Uh, it's a mixed media new thing coming to the market and they are looking for people to create with their products. Again, uh, their Facebook page will be below in the video so you can, you can read and you can see maybe you would like to uh, send your email and become their part, part of their team. Um, uh, going back to the challenge theme, uh, there is a new challenge, color challenge, on Lindy Stamp Gang uh, blog. I'm sure you are aware of the Lindy Stamp Gang sprays. Uh, those are absolutely fantastic mixed media sprays to play with. I had a chance to create a project for this color challenge and this is a card that I made. It's hard to show in this light because I must have a light that you can see me properly but the card isn't as pretty <laughs> as without the light. Anyway, you can see uh, you can see the color is basically Christmassy. Uh, they are having the, the whole month, the challenge run for the whole month and there is five winners and all those five will uh, will get a voucher, gift certificates of fifty dollars to spend in store. I think it's a great price, so way worth it to play. Um, what else? Actually, I'll tell you about my must-have product, and again, it's gonna be about Lindy, uh, because honestly, this is something I cannot live without. A white spray from Lindy. I have found three bottles. I'm sure I have more somewhere. They are they are all empty, unfortunately. Uh, I have to get some new ones. Um, this is Frozen Jack Frost. This is one of those colors that it's just a must-have in your in your stash. I nearly use it like my water. If I have to dilute something, move my color around. I just grab my white spray. It's just, it just works. 
nicer than the water most of the time. The color is flat, it's like a chalk finish, uh, so it's a fantastic coverage. Uh, frozen Jack Frost, white Lindy Stamp Gang Spray, uh, my number one after a few many or before a few many. Ginny Mac, I just know that it's gonna be so hard to record vlog, vlog, vlogging. Lord. So this is my number... Uh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> So guys, I hope you have enjoyed this a little chit chat, this little talk. It's like an interview with myself. Um, I I hope you will let me know what you think. Leave me a comment. Uh, say a few words. How do you find this uh, this whole idea of talking to you, looking at you, or you can actually look at me? I have to tell you. It's very exciting to do it. Uh, it is really exciting. It's rewarding because it's something new. I love challenge myself. Oh, but it's extremely, extremely stressful. Uh, English is not my first language, which you already know, and I've mentioned it before. So it's not easy to actually speak in different language. Uh, at the same time, trying to concentrate on uh, the accent, the informations I'm giving you, and yet the cra the grammar that I speak, um, oh, it's just uh, it's challenging. I love it, but it's challenging and stressful, and I'm glad it's over. <laughs> Um, I hope I will continue this journey and I hope I will be back to you with some new new stuff, some other news and I will show you some products, some must-have. Well, oh, actually I forgot about one thing, something that inspired me this week and it's gonna be a beautiful, amazing, sensational canvas. Very simple in one way, but just incredible in all other ways. It's a canvas made by Anna Ivanovska. She created this piece for Mixed Media Place, uh, Mixed Media Place uh, website. It's a store, online store that, store that sells online products, but also they run monthly challenge. So she created a, a fabulous, fabulous canvas, which, which actually I hope I will I will sit down and try to uh, get inspiration from that. It's textured, uh, the amazing texture, wonderful composition, fantastic color, just something special. Again, link will be below. Um, so please, 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 if you liked the video, uh, share it with your friends, ha have a thumbs up, um, and subscribe to my channel. I do hope I'll make more Unless you're gonna say, no, 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 it's just, it's not enough funny because I'm not really a funny person. I don't know how to say jokes and be funny. But I hope you had just nice time. That's what I hope. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> I'll talk to you soon. Maybe very soon. Bye-bye.